Coach Beheim's squad is used to getting big contributions from his Canadian players, but SU men's soccer also scores some talent from up north. Alex Hallis, Chris Nanko, Jordan Morell, and Skylar Thomas. Coach McIntyre has used the Orange's history with recruiting Canadian talent. From Patrice, and we've had a, a number of quality players, um, had a chance to, to coach against uh, a number of these guys. So, no, I've understood that there's a, a fine tradition. The man in charge of recruiting Canada is assistant coach Mike Miller. It just really happens to be right now that, you know, Toronto being about four hours away, you know, the kids and their families, they're really interested in Syracuse University. We're always looking to extend our recruiting network. Uh, that's what we're working on right now to get more into Montreal, Ottawa, get out there to Vancouver, um, and really always be in the running for some of the best Canadian players. To grab the top talent, Coach Miller contacted the technical director, Bobby Shamirniotis, from the Toronto-based club, Sigma FC. We've been blessed because uh, our players, even those players in the past, and you know, we had a, from our first group of graduating players a few years ago. You know, the first ones came out this past year. Two of them went in the first round of the MLS draft. So our players have given us a very good name. We've done a good job with our players, but our, all our players who've gone down and played in the college ranks have all done well at their respective schools. And from the start when I met Bobby, we, you know, we we hit it off, we clicked. So from then on, I mean, from this day, I still love him. So. They developed me, like, developed some of my skills, like my touches, my runs off the ball, and everything like that. And besides the love for soccer, the Canadians can also relate by where they grew up. Considering we could uh, go home with each other uh, during Christmas break or whatever and hang out back at home, whereas not everyone on the team could do that, so uh, we have a special bond, I would say, yeah. For my brothers, I always look out for them, they look out for us. It's, throughout the whole team, it is, we always look out for each other, but those guys are always around my house or I'm around Skylar's house, and they always happen to be there. They're like, as I said, our little brothers, and we put them under our wing because we're older. Luckily for the Cuse, this orange squad just might be getting more Canadian. John Paul Chunga, Citrus TV.